hi in this uh, session we would check upon dma so we are not going to read the entire dma theory uh, it is just a practical application uh, i am taking i2c as an example here uh, we can see that uh, we have i2c mem read uh, the blocking way uh, we also have the interrupt way and the dma way uh, in the dma way there is a small misconception that uh, we are going to clear we'll use gpio toggles uh, for understanding for a better understanding so here we go basically uh, i2c mem read and i2c mem read dma have the same parameters it is just that uh, the data is populated in the background so if uh, we expect um, the read activity to be complete just after this function gets executed we are wrong so uh, since we said earlier we are using gpio toggles basically we are uh, toggling the pin 13 set and reset uh, between this function and uh, uh, the other pin 14 is uh, set here just like pin 13 but it is reset inside the it, it.c this is where the dma read actually gets complete so uh, we can clearly see here that the pin 13 is high just like pin 14 uh, but pin 13 gets low uh, once the read activity is set up if you want to check uh, understand the i2c read sequence you can check uh, the other video but uh, here we are concerned about this small topic of dma so uh, we can see that uh, the gpio goes low just when the scheduling of uh, write is complete that is uh, after this if you were going to have in this example you, you have just one byte of data but if you are going to have chunks of data and if you are going to read or uh, read the data below here somewhere here uh, you will be wrong so um, basically that also hints to us that if we have a local variable here and if we are going to perform other tasks this uh, local variable is totally meaningless uh, below here so it is essential that we should have a global uh, variable and uh, understand accordingly and schedule in such a way that uh, the read activity gets complete remembering that the read activity gets complete inside the dma isr i hope uh, this is clear to us uh, please let me know in comments if you have any further questions thank you